Hey everybody, Dale here. In this little short video, I'm going to show you how to fix the QuickBooks license error. It's very common, especially after doing like a hard drive clone. Let's say you have QuickBooks installed and you got a new SSD, for example, and you clone your hard drive to the new drive, then you go to run QuickBooks, you're going to get the license error box. It's very simple to fix. Basically, we're just going to go over to this PC or my computer, open that up, open up your C drive. Let's go up to view right here. We're going to show all the hidden items. Then we're going to go into the program data folder right here. Double click. Then you're going to find your Intuit folder right here. Double click. Then you're going to go into the entitlement client folder. Double click. Go into the V8 folder. And then this little file right here. We're going to delete it. It's that simple. So just right click on it or hit the delete key on your keyboard. Boom, it's gone. Then the next time you launch QuickBooks, that file will automatically be regenerated. And then you're going to get to the activation box or registration box. And you're going to choose one of those three options there simply to reactivate your QuickBooks. Try the email one first. This is going to be the email that you used when you originally registered your QuickBooks. Now this fix works for all versions of QuickBooks, as far as I know, all the way back to when they required activation or registration. And all versions of Windows 7, 8, and 10. And once you put in your email or your phone and you reactivate it, your QuickBooks is going to work perfect. Works every time, all the time. See you next time. I hope this video was helpful. And don't forget, subscribe. See you next time.